What did you do? I don't know. Why have we stopped? The loser legion must have hit something when they ambushed us. Right, Groot. Guys, it's only a matter of time before the galaxy accepts the promise. Sacrosanct is back there. We can't just sit here. Nice. And how are we going to do that? We're dead in the fucking water. And if they find us, we freely accepted. Oh, oh yeah, and without an engine, we're screwed Guys, anyway. guys, guys, guys. Enough. Just stop already. I can't hear myself think. Rocket, fix the engines. How am I supposed to do that? I can't even run a diagon- I don't care! Just fix it! Scoff. Then what are we supposed to do? I don't know, okay? I can't just conjure up answers every two seconds. Fine. Don't. I just can't do this right now. I need some rest. Screw Noble Core. Shouldn't have counted on them in the first place. Drax, I, uh... I do not wish to talk. Fair enough. We're all pretty spent, just... Try to get some rest if you can. Look, it's our great leader. Shoot. <laughs> what the? That's how you got in? smells great this how are you me come on the talking raccoon's waiting for you everybody is uh rocket yeah he was fixing that thing that broke hey if we're some kind of big space hero now why are we running from the bad uh, guys it's complicated no it's not stop running and we've landed uh <clears throat> Groot wanted to let you sleep. Can you believe it? Oh, how long was I out? Long enough to fly us all the way to the quarantine zone. Wait, how do we fly out here? Quill, do you want to fix your ship or not? My ship. 
Yes, your ship. Come on, the others are outside. Is everyone outside already? Yep, waiting for us. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> out of bed the rodent made decisions in your sleep yeah yeah I know took you long enough what Nikki you're not supposed to be here you promised you would get me out of here I know but <sighs> Nikki Hovat and Camaria will be restored. Uh, yeah, okay. Um, we just need to have faith. <laughs> uh, Drax, kind of freaking me out, man. I had to share the good news, Peter Quill. You have lost your family, your mother, the Cree woman. You understand that pain comes from loss. Drax. But with faith, with the Matriarch's promise, our families can be restored. I, I, Drax, I don't... You have accepted her promise, have you not, Peter Quill? I... Totally accepted it. I am super stoked to, to see my mom again. And rejoin your daughter. I guess, right, right, my, my daughter. I knew you would see the truth of her light, Peter Quill. Yep, uh, the truth and light, dead. Not dead, uh, my daughter, it's all super great. This pleases me. I am less certain of the others. A wooden one may come around, but I suspect the assassin and the rodent will resist. Mm -hmm. This makes them a dangerous element for our cause. I must eliminate them. Wait! Why? Because <sighs> they're our family, man. Just give them a chance. It's a lot to process. Do you truly believe they will accept her promise? I, I know it. Uh, take Gamora. Her dad was Thanos. There's gonna be some stuff to work through before she can accept it. And, and Rocket. <laughs> Where to start? He's literally a walking science experiment. What Nikki, uh, the, the matriarch, is, is offering, it's, it's all new territory for him. And the wooden one? You said it yourself. He'll come around. I mean, it's Groot, man. He's our rock. Very well, Peter Quill. Good, uh, good. That's 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 great. Um, I'll, I'll let the others know. Ah, there is no need. We must bring the matriarch here. We'll give them the time they require to consider her promise. Right, uh, right. Because she's a million light years away, and it'll take us time to get there. Already landed on her planet. What? What? Why? Why would you do that? If you had truly accepted her promise, you would know. 
Perhaps it is better that you wait here for a while. Contemplate your faith. Wait! Drax! We can talk about this! Great. I'm here, Rocket. Oh, thank Clark. Peter, Rocket, why is my door locked from the outside? Yeah, Drax may have kind of joined the church. What? Seriously? <laughs> I know, it's, it, it's super messed up, Drax. Drax is kind of messed up. He also may have landed us on Sacrosanct to find the matriarch. But don't worry. I may have an idea. The llama thing's been chewing through my wall. Cammy did? If I can just squeeze through and get to the cockpit. You can release the locks. Bingo! Okay, I'm out. Are you excited, Drax? Not yet. Worth a try. Uh, so, guess who gets to fix the bulkhead when all this is done? Assuming we don't die first. <laughs> Bet your bark, it's me. And if it weren't for me, the Milano would still be floating dead in space right now. You're welcome, by the way. Yeah, we're real grateful that you fixed the ship in time for Drax to hijack it. I know, and I was just checking. Well, go check the cockpit instead. The good news is we're not on the sacrosanct. The bad news is I have no idea where we are. We'll worry about it later. Focus on letting us out. Right. Done. Meet me in the rec room. Oh, 
Clark been waiting for. We gotta dish this mud ball before Green and Crazy shows up with his new pal, the Kurtakin Matriarch. Clark, it stopped. We can't just abandon Drax. Is he even still Drax? I mean, he's been converted. I know. It's just we need to find him and pull him back from the dark side. You're talking about kidnapping Drax the Destroyer. Emphasis on Destroyer. And we've come too far, seen too much awful stuff to abandon one of our friends. Drax is still our friend. That ain't our friend no more. Don't make me pull rank on this, man. Are you pointing your frickin' guns at me? No, no, not yet. I just need you to understand how serious this is. We're not leaving. Well, Clark Quill. It's about Kratak and time you showed some Nords. Fine, I'm in. Any other objections? Nope, I'm good. I'm good. Good, then let's go find our friend. I hope you ain't just browsing. Maybe I am. Might be bad. I'm oh, so sorry. Yeah. Nothing shiny to show for it. Yep. Shame. Sorry. <clears throat> Ready to go out there and get Drax back? Ready? No. But the longer we wait, the further he'll drift away. Okay. Here we go. Not this place. You know where we are? In a Flarkin Lagoon? How many times I gotta tell you people, I don't like water! Hey, I didn't land here, okay? Drax did. Ah, oh, the stuff is gross! Ah, uh, are you kidding me? Ah, wet fur is the worst! Fuck <laughs> it! You alright? That's it! I hate water! I hate being wet! And I hate not getting paid! <coughs> We're not here to get paid. We're here to save tracks. Guys, this is Lamentis, home of the priests of Pama. More religious nut jobs. Great. They aren't nuts. They're pacifist exiles. Pacifists. That's even worse. You saw them on Nowhere? So how do you know this place? I came here after a job went bad. What kind of job? It involved my sister, and it's not relevant right now. If Drax thinks this is the Matriarch's planet, something's off. Uh, tell me we ain't crossing above an ocean. Only part of an ocean. Uh... Don't fall, you won't get wet. Yeah? Well, how do you know Drax didn't fall? Quit worrying, Rocket. Anything happens, Gamora will jump in after you. I will? You will? Yes, because we're a team. And Gamora's the most sprightly. Uh, I think I'd rather drown. We should sink on our plan for when we find Drax. Shoot first, plan later. We're not shooting Drax. But you were willing to... Found oh. Drax. Where is she? Where is the matriarch? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Put him down! Drax, buddy, just calm down! No, she called me here! Men were lost! Rocket, a little help here? Uh. <laughs> This is that place. You... What? Oh, that. Lysa once taught me the artist strike <clears throat> the spot in many times. Is it on bad? He teaches me later. 
Don't worry, green thing is fine. <clears throat> fine what are we doing here, Mantis? I told him to come on nowhere. I saw time inside his mind. The lies that bind. I mean, what's a girl to do? Whisper a course correct, obviously. It's okay. Stay with me. Quiet in the dark. Another one of your girlfriends, Quill? Oh, no. <laughs> Not in this time. Come on, the creepy cave's this way. The what now? The creepy cave, where the darkest of our future paths will meet. Dark is an unknown, not as in bad. I mean, it might be bad, but no way can it be worse than the futures I did see, because those were definitely bad, very bad. You don't want to know how bad. Can someone please translate her? <laughs> the point is, or was, or, which parts of the point have I made already? Uh, the creepy cave. Yes, that's right. Big strong heart carries so much sorrow inside. In all futures, he's the one who turns. And in some, we save him, here. And here we are, where the Kotati take root. So, just to be clear, there's a timeline where me and you... Peter. Focus. Right. Uh, what's a Katati? I am. Uh, plant people like Groot, but uh, lame. The Kotati are a highly evolved, highly sacred race of pacifist beings who grace us with their meditative powers. They also guard the secrets of the ancient cave. Can they temporarily unguard it? Oh no, they take this duty quite seriously. Our only hope of entering is to appeal to their infinite wisdom. And we're in! That is definitely the best game for Groot. Maybe there's one that's going to be even better, but... Uh, what are we looking for in here? She doesn't know. Something that's going to help Drax. We're all just taking the word of the space case. She's not a space... Ooh, spooky! He's right. Uh, more like that. Are we sure about this? Nope. Maybe Drax just needs to sleep it off. I mean, he seems fine ish. My telepathic control won't last, little fuzzy. Double floor! Yeah. Allison sets that one in time. Everyone just remember we're here for Drax. So, it would be easier if we had some idea of what we're looking for. Oh, for sure. It's always easier when you know things. Like, no, no. But you don't. Not yet. Whoa. This is really unstable. That's the cave's gonna kill us all. Oh, no, not all of us. Not this time. Mm -hmm. More water? What's wrong with this lousy planet? Doesn't seem that bad. Come on, Rocket. The water's not gonna hurt you. That's why drowning's actually quite common throughout Little Fuzzy Boulder. I have heard so many of his panic final gasps. Okay, let's not tell little Fuzzy that. <laughs> nice! Whatever you found in there. Well, pretty sure it ain't worth getting threatened for. Wait, no, wait. You aren't gonna like it. Well, which is it? 
I guess that'll depend on who you are when you're there. I'm sure it'll get drier from here on out. Oh, you are so wrong, Stir Fry. <laughs> Stir Fry, that's a good one. You've been smiling a lot more, Gamora. See, I told you being in a group would help. I mean, seeing Rocket freak out over water is kind of fun. Maybe let's not make Rocket hate being here more than he already does. I yeah. Crap! That one sometimes gets the more us. You're sure we're headed the right way, Mantis? I think so. Okay, well, it's too wide to jump here. We'll need to look around, find another way. Let's take a look through here. Maybe there's another way to cross. We could try using that huge crystal somehow. All right, Gamora, let's get up here. Why don't I just blast some of these rocks? Oh, no! I don't trust them not to kill us. What's your reason? I have seen so many futures where a little fuzzy dies in this cave. Rocket, you feeling lucky? I got this. Rocket, just stay to the side and try not to die. Yo, geniuses. This thing above me don't look too sturdy. Knock it loose and we got our bread. Try your blasters, Peter. something for us. Name one time. Remember when he saved our butts in that mining ship? Scott, he saved your butt. Uh, this is a lot of trouble to go to for a freaking colleague. Drax has definitely been there for us before. Like on Segnar. First time we got jumped by that tiger with the squid face. Who? Oh, Stumpy? And the second time we got jumped by Stumpy. Uh, Mantis? Are you really worried about this fog? Okay, I take it back. Having normal tracks around would have been useful just then. What are the odds of those things living on this planet? Maybe they weren't native to Seknar? And this is where Hellbender first got them? Or maybe Hellbender's here, tracking us across the ends of the galaxy, because she wants us dead. Lady H wants us dead. You realize what that means? We're all gonna die? I think I see what he's doing. It means we're a team. When we piss someone off, we piss them off together. I'm gonna assume that sounded better in your head. Water, fog, and monsters. What's the forking deal with this place? There has always been a great power here. The priests tell tales of those who were here before them, and what wonderful things they could do. I don't remember hearing anything about that. You weren't ready to listen last time you were here. Are you? Why were you here again, Gamora? Oh, I know the answer. What the fuck? <laughs> There's two of them. Two of what? Mantis, do these things have anything to do with what we're looking for? Inconclusive. Did he actually but say that? I'm thinking or are you just no. trying to get us to turn around? What do you think, Will? New best friends? Yeah, maybe not.
We're looking for? Not sure if I want to dance or not. Whatever gets us out of here. Oh, there's that feeling again. The fur on the back of my neck is sticking up. I feel it too, like a pair of eyes watching you. Rocket, think you can crawl in there? For what? So I can get eaten by whatever lives inside? The stone faces. Whatever we're looking for is beyond or beneath or behind one of the faces. What do you say, Rocket? I bet you can find us a way back there. Fine. Whatever. <coughs> oh, smells like rotten spike eggs in here. Okay. Setting the charge. Stand back. I don't think this is the one where you killed him. this? Here's good. No, there ain't nothing he needs to know about me. Keep your bar full shot. Greenie's lost in an ocean of lies. We need to bring him ashore, but we also need to remain grounded in the positive. We're his lifeline. Positivity isn't exactly our strong suit. You always underestimated yourself, Gamora. I spy with my little eye. You find anything, Peter? Anything there that can save Drax. Is there another face somewhere, Mantis? Mantis? Huh? Oh, yeah. This cave is multifaceted. Get it? See that, Green Meanie? That's where we need to be. You, uh, see something out there, Mantis? So many things, too many things. Shadows of a civilization that lived here once before. Forlorn faces that can see, like me, horrors yet to come. And other shadows, too. Ours, not ours. A figure that's watching us now. Or was watching us then. I see rocks and, uh, crystal things. A statue that looks like a face more rocks. I like yours better. I see something else. I see friends willing to die for another friend. Yeah, well, I'm hoping it doesn't come to that. Me too, Star Guy. Me too. We'll each need to face our fears. 
some here, some not. But facing them is most important. You know, running is sometimes good too. Found another way. Just me or them crystals look super dangerous. Don't worry your fuzzy little head. You only die from a great fall in two timelines. This probably isn't one of them. <laughs> Don't let your thoughts wander, it's not safe. Be focused on drafts. Yes, carrying to Cammy. Wait, who's Cammy? It's a long story. Ooh, my favorite guy. We need to get on those crystals, Groot. Just let Quill get out there first. I don't want you falling. Definitely remembering something now, I think. We need to be careful here. I think what you're seeing is some version of me pushing you off a cliff. Oh, little fuzzy. Your volatility is surprisingly consistent through all versions of time and space. Maybe we need to accept that not everything can be explained. Galaxy's a weird place. Just gotta go with the flow. Getting lost in a deadly cave is your idea of going with the flow? We aren't lost, little fuzzy. At least, not in this version. We're recovering what other versions of us have already found. Isn't it exciting? If you want to stop Rooker, finally, the face of a thousand lies, I think. It help us save the rats. It tries to keep us from saving him. We seek something behind the face, beyond the lies. You want me to blow it up? That shouldn't be our answer to everything. Here goes the sky! Watch out, everybody! Uh, thanks. You don't usually make it. The Kotati mentioned the spaces in the dark before. But I always thought it was metaphorical. Bug lady is absolutely bonkers. <laughs> of course I'm angry. I'm what? Wandering around a cave that's falling apart, looking for Flark knows what. We'll need a hand, Groot. <laughs> Not him. Can you get us through here, Gamora? Flark is. I'm going in. No, you mustn't. You don't want me to cut the thing? Wait, no, not you. Something bad is about to happen. Oh, that's it. I'm going in. Fuck it. Blow up the statue, save Drax, and get out of here. Yes, but... Time to start crushing our instincts, Quill. Bug Lady said the face is keeping us from helping Drax, so we gotta destroy it. Little Fuzzy, don't do whatever it is you're about to do. No, 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 no. I'm done with all the riddles. Don't, don't, don't do whatever you're about to do. Just hear Mantis out on this, okay? Give me a kick to think. Did she or did she not say this thing is in our way? Yes. Rocket, go! Rocket Pillock. Close one.